All right, guys, let me show you how to complete the Steel and Jar SBC on FIFA 23. So, if you guys will enjoy this video, and if you do, please smash the like button down below. So, the time recording currently costs around 365k for this SBC. You do get six packs back as well. So, for the packs back, two red gold players pack, two red gold players pack, gold pack, prime mix players pack, prime relics and players pack, and also rare relics and players pack. So, the first two squads are going to be the usual two squads. So, for the very first one, Ignore the players in the team just here. All you want to do, jump on the market, bronze rare, find the cheapest rare bronze cards and just pick up the 11 cheapest ones you can pick up and put them in the team and now complete that SBC. For the next part, exactly the same but of rare silver cards. Once again, ignore the players in the team, just jump on the market just here. Silver rare, find the cheapest ones, currently around 650. Pick up 11, put them in the team and now complete that squad. Next up, one player from Liverpool, 84 for the rating. Now, this squad at the time recording currently costs around 34,000 coins. So, what you want to do, pick up the three Chiefs 85 cards. So, um, Vardy, Galaski, Summer, all currently cost around 7,000 coins. Then, you want to pick up two 84 cards. So, um, Tadic, Martinez, both currently cost around 3,300 coins. Then, you want to pick up three 83 cards. So, um, Hoiberg, Zapata, Jimenez, all cost around 900 coins each. Then, up top, three 82 cards. These cards, very to pick up, 700 coins each. So, um, Olmo, Voland, and also Nunes. Picked up Nunes to tick off the Liverpool requirements. So, that's one way to do that. Potentially, if his price does go up for an 83 card, Henderson, Firmino, used very close to like the Chiefs A3 cards. Matip as well, used very close to like the Chiefs A4 cards. So, potentially, may need to like bring him in just there, bring in a different A2 card, or potentially one of these two going to the midfield and then just a different A2 card there. So, that's going to be it for that squad. For the next one, one player from England, 85 for the rating. So this squad currently costs around 59,000 coins. For the solution, it's going to be 187 cards. So Rodri currently costs, well, currently costs 15,500, but the price, it keeps going up and down by a few K. So um, that price may be slightly different, but yeah, hopefully it's about 15,500. Next up, you want to pick up two A6 cards. So um, Trap, Parejo, currently both around 11,000 coins. Then you want to pick up 285, so Galaski, Summer, both around 7,000 coins. Then you want to pick up 6A3 cards. Once again, these cards currently cost around 900 coins. So um, Jimenez, Zapata, Darren Silva, Stones, Luis Alberto, Hoiberg. Also, make sure you get the English player as well. So for me, guys, Stones just there as he is one of the Chiefs A3 cards. And that's going to complete that squad. Next up, 86 for the rating, one team the week card required as well. So for this one, Currently costs 109k, so for the Team of the Week card, Tarimi, he's going to be the player you want to pick up. If there is a cheaper A17 of the Week card, then pick them up instead. But for Tarimi, he's currently around 27, 28,000 coins. The price, it is changing quite a bit because he's just came out. But the moment, yeah, 27,500 there. So pick up the Chiefs A17 of the Week card. Then you want to pick up two gold A7 cards. So um, Rodri, Verratti, both currently cost around 15,500. But as mentioned with the previous squad, the price to 87s, it keeps going up and down by a few K, so maybe slightly different. Then you want to pick up 386 cards, once again, around 11K each, so for my ones. Trap, Parejo, actually 4 even, Lukaku and Mendy, so 486 cards. And then you want to pick up 483 cards, so Zapata, Hoiberg, Dad Silva, Luis Alberto, all cost around 900 coins each. Then for the final squad, one Premier League player, 87 for the rating. Currently costs around 153k for the solution. It's going to be 189. Harry Kane carrying the cheapest one at 33k. Then you want to pick up 488 cards. So 88, carrying around 24k each. So um, got Silva, Cruz, Donnarumma, Modric, kind of the four cheapest ones. A lot of the time, Kalo Navas, he's one of the cheapest ones, but the time recording, he's the fifth cheapest one. So that's what we've got these four. Then next up, just want to pick up 185 card, which is going to be solid just there. Currently costs 7k. And then 584 cards. So these cards, all around 3,300 coins. Tillemans, Mertens, Handanovic, Tadic, Martinez. That completes the SBC. 365k at the time recording. I'm not sure what his market price is actually. So just going to check that quickly to see if the value is pretty good. But 365k for the SBC. Potentially can grind as well to make it a little bit cheaper. And I'd say it seems like an okay price on the market though. How much is he going to be? A very similar price so um the sbc probably do want to grind it because like on the market cheaper if you're doing it from scratch then yeah probably just better off picking up a tradable card but 
If you're going to grind the SBC, use some untradables, then potentially maybe worth it. But from scratch, would definitely avoid it.